Hi, Bob the teacher here. Just washing my hands. Have you washed yours too? You need to do some science in school. Science outdoors. You can even do science at home. At the moment we're stuck at home, so let's go do some science. For today's experiment, you'll need a candle, something like a little tea light, and a clear glass. I wonder what will happen if I cover the candle with the glass. What do you think? Let's find out. Oh, nothing seems to happen. Oh, but does it? Well, the candle has got out. I wonder why. What do you think? Will the candle light up when I lift the glass? Nope. So here we have a chance to do some real experimenting. You'll see I have three different glass tumblers, all of different sizes, different capacities. We say different volumes. And we have a clock to time how long the candle flame lasts. So by covering the flame with three different glasses, different volumes, we can see the effect on the candle flame. Look at the clock. We'll start the experiment when the second hand gets to 12. Your job is to watch the candle and the clock. How long does the flame take to go out? Let's go. Out! 10 seconds! I've lit the candle flame again. We're going to use the middle sized glass now. I wonder how long the candle will last. More than 10 seconds or less? Here we go. Ten seconds, it's still there. And it's out at 15 seconds. That's a new result. I'm going to write that down. Now we've relit the candle flame. It's time to use the tall glass. It's the biggest volume. I wonder how long the candle will last in the big glass. I think you've got a good idea. Let's try. Ten seconds is past. That's fifteen. Twenty. Still there. And it's gone. That's twenty eight seconds. Did you see it was twenty?